Louis Tomlinson fires back at some rude radio hosts that called him the least popular member of One Direction. This episode is brought to you by T-Mobile, America's best unlimited network. But don't worry, Louis got back at the host with the help of some loyal Twitter trolls. Who in their right mind thinks they can shade a celebrity while introducing them in an interview? Spoiler alert, you can't. Australian radio host Ash London and her co-host Ash Williams and Ed Cavalli said some rather rude things about Louis Tomlinson while introducing his interview on their show. And by rude, we're talking about this. He's the guy with the smaller face with the short brown hair, yeah? That doesn't know. Kind of like ratty, like ratty, um, ratty facial hair. Yeah. He's not Harry Styles, basically. He's quite skinny. <laughs> He's the least popular one. Yeah, I've got him. Yep. So on top of not knowing exactly who Louis Tomlinson is, they made fun of his small head, his ratty facial hair, called him skinny, said he's basically not Harry Styles, and called Louis the least popular one of the group. And we wonder why we have a bullying problem in the world. Anyways, Ash London tried to save her show after all that saying, quote, but he surprised us with all his solo music. But unfortunately for her, the damage was already done. Even though Ash didn't say most of the nasty words, it was her show. Once Louis fans got wind of the interview, they came for Ash the only way they know how, on Twitter. One fan responded, he's Louis Tomlinson, the one with the biggest charity rep. He's the one with the big heart. Off Ash London. These responses prompted Ash to make a statement on Twitter writing, We love Louis and will continue supporting him and his new music as we have always done. But that wasn't really good enough for fans, seeing as that wasn't an apology. Ash tweeted again, but this time apologizing for describing Louis' facial hair, but not for the other things that were said. Ash ended by saying, I'll be off socials for a bit. The abuse and threats are a bit much for me right now. And in an interesting turn of events, Louis himself chimed into the conversation. He responded directly to Ash's tweet with some shade of his own, writing, quote, Probs best to stay on private for a bit longer, love. Yep, he also included the middle finger emoji, and yes, his tweet is hilarious. But some folks think this is not cool of Louis to encourage his fans that make threats online. But the question is, what do you guys think? Was Louis right to tweet back at her rude comments, or should he have stayed out of it? Tell us your opinion below, and as always, thank you so much for watching. I'm your host, Emil Ennis Jr. You can find me at Emil Ennis Jr., and I will see you soon. Now click here to witness Harry Styles locking lips with James Corden. This episode was brought to you by T-Mobile. Switch to America's best unlimited network.